UMSL hosts Lincoln University for a men's and women's swim meet. There is something particularly special about today's competition. The reason? It has been 20 years since UMSL has hosted this type of sport. The question is, why now? A department resource tells me that UMSL swim team began with the men's in 1971 and the women's in 1977. The sport was dropped in 1995-96 seasons. Then, the sport picked back up in 2014-15, but it was not ready to host, and it did not have a large enough squad at the time. But now, they have a large enough team to host swim meets. So, we did very well as a team, absolutely. Uh, it was one of our, I think, most confident performance so far. So, that's, that's very good. Um, individually, we, we will get better. Even if you don't say it, you get goosebumps and the crowd was uh, very good today, very large, uh, a really good number uh, and we, we, we really didn't know what to expect but um, I have a feeling that there's going to be uh, some extra extra push for us. We are very young, very young, we have uh, basically more than half of the team is brand new. I swam the 100 fly. 100 back and 200 back and the first one was the relay 100 uh, I swam the, the fly on relay and how did you think you did during your events oh for the the mid off season I think was a good like a good practice mm -hmm. to swim a lot of events in a short of time mm -hmm. so I think I did great but having having everyone fresh ready to go excited about um, getting stronger, getting faster, getting uh, it on the same boat and yeah, that's, that's, that's the strength we have. We just need to aim it all the same way. So sometimes we are uh, up and down, but I think that we step up today. So. And after 20 years, UMSL has successfully brought back swimming to the Mark Twain gym. And as it turns out, both men and women's swim team won today. This is Ashley Carlstrom from the UTV.